Okay, here we go. We're going to have BYOB on gold and uh, hard workers on blue. Um, BYOB, uh, one of the uh, strongest teams from last week's tournament. Um, we'll see what kind of moves uh, they have uh, this week. <laughs> Okay, so uh, here we go. Uh, right off the bat, uh, Gold taking control of the center, doing both Econ and moving the snail. It uh, doesn't look like they want to do a switch, they just want to threaten a little bit. Uh, we have a pretty good military presence uh, out from BYOB on Gold, um, shutting down a lot of uh, Blue's military and killing the Queen. Uh, so right now they have a little bit of Econ lead. Their snail is actually moving. Uh, it's all halfway across uh, to their goal now. Um, so they may be thinking that with their stronger military presence, they just want to push the snail uh, and get the win in. Uh, that having been said, uh, Blue's now moving the snail back, and they have a strong military out again to, to counter Gold's military. Um, ooh, that speed worker for Blue gets eaten. That's unfortunate. Blue's also pushing a little bit of econ. However, they've only just tied it up. Blue now has no military out, which means that this snail is going to be very, very hard to shut down. Excellent little uh, hop off from the gold worker to eat the blue, uh, the blue worker. So, so good job there. Um, and gold pulls uh, the snail in for uh, an easy snail victory, uh, bringing them one up against hard workers on blue. So here we are uh, with BYOB on gold and hard workers on blue. Uh, blue uh, getting a little bit of military out here at, very, uh, at the very beginning, uh, doing their best maybe to harass uh, what they think is a, a gold economic push. But it looks like gold might be trying to push the snail once again. They don't get speed, but they seem to be happy just sort of uh, concertedly uh, pushing that snail the whole game. Uh, Blue Queen goes down, um, and uh, it looks like Blue is maybe trying to do a little bit of economic. Uh, they have a speed worker uh, doing that, but speed worker doesn't seem to be like, finding their way up to the hive, if that's their goal, is to put that barrier. Um, gold now harassing the hive, so that blue worker kind of missed their uh, missed their window. Um, gold moving the snail across, but now it's being moved back by gold, uh, sorry, by, by blue. Uh, but gold re takes repossession, uh, kills the blue queen, and now they're uh, free to go. Uh, blue worker then uh, sw swoops in to kill uh, the gold uh, snail rider. <coughs> Gold's been pushing a little bit of econ while this is all going along, um, and doesn't have really any soldiers out besides their harasser. Blue getting a little bit of a stronger military presence out, um, but unfortunately it's not doing them uh, much good. Uh, although they have got, uh, gotten the econ uh, pretty much tied up. Um, Snail, however, continues to move. Gold, confident that uh, they just need a little bit of defense in order to, to keep uh, to keep to keep the snail moving, and they they might be right. Uh, it seems like. Uh, Blue is having a, a lot of trouble. Oh, and there we go. Uh, a fight over the snail leads to the Blue Queen being taken out uh, by a gold soldier. Um, <clears throat> that's the tough thing. If, you're, if your queen is down to her last life, then it can be very, very dangerous uh, for her to come in and scrap. Uh, especially if you've got soldiers that, uh, that, you know, it doesn't matter as much if they die. So... All right, uh, here we are, BYOB uh, on gold, uh, maybe looking to shut this out. They immediately get on the snail again. It's worked for them so far. I don't see why they would stop. Uh, Blue Queen going out and uh, harassing a little bit of the econ, uh, while uh, Blue Worker uh, takes the snail back a little bit. Um, uh, Blue seems to be concentrating much more now on military to shut down the snail, uh, even taking out the gold queen in an attempt to, to do that. Um, so... That's uh, that's good for them. Um, right now, sna a blue snail rider right getting chased off. Uh, blue pushing a little bit of econ, but not much. Back on the snail, blue moving it across. Blue's military doing a much better job here of protecting their uh, the, the snail uh, and the snail rider. Um, uh, really, uh, I would say not a hugely you know uh, each 
team going for sort of a multifaceted uh, approach to this, uh, pushing a little bit of econ, worrying about the snail, getting a little bit of uh, military out. They kind of don't want to go all in on one strategy or another. Um, ooh, nice. Uh, the gold queen outmaneuvers the blue queen and takes her out. Uh, they're now tied up in, uh, in kills. Um, uh, blue continues to move the uh, snail across, but uh, gold is now taking possession of it and is moving back across. Uh, queen trying to chase away that gold soldier. Uh, for some reason, instead of taking out the uh, the gold snail rider, uh, snail now having a return to center, um, it's hard to say what uh, strategies these teams might uh, move into. A uh, blue queen uh, down again to her last life. She's not going to be able to have the presence that blue might want uh, because right now, the, and right now they have no other military out. So uh, she's going to have to doing a lot of work when she's very, very vulnerable. Um, and Gold is, is knows this and is doing everything they can to just keep control of the gates, make sure no blue military comes out. Um, while this is all going on, Blue is doing a decent job of uh, getting their econ to, to keep moving. Um, a blue soldier there now spawned out to give the, the queen a little bit of a relief. We'll see uh, what they can do. Um, now we'll have two blue soldiers out, but it looks like they've stopped pushing econ. Uh, which I don't know uh, how, how good an idea is that. That is, uh, and gold is uh, moving back into eco. Blue now back on the snail, moving it across, although it's it's just uh, gonna move right back into uh, the middle position. Uh, seems like it's probably a little late now for, for a snail push. Um, but Econ continues a pace for both of these teams. Uh, it looks like they're pretty evenly matched. And there we go. Uh, Blue Queen takes out the Gold Queen, meaning that they are all tied up. Um, now, uh, what that means as far as harassment potential goes, uh, there's not really any Gold military out to speak of. Um, and so they're not really doing much to harass Blue's Econ, which is now almost, well, now has tied up with Gold. So, uh, the snail continues to go back and forth, and there we go, an amazing dive uh, from uh, blue side to take out BYOB's queen uh, and get their first win of the round. Uh, so very impressive on their side. Uh, excellent dive from their queen. Um, hard workers there showing, showing uh, what their name really means. Uh, they're, they're not going to give up until, uh, until it's actually over. Alright, so here we go into our uh, third game of the match. Uh, we have uh, both teams pushing a little bit of econ. Uh, blue going a little bit stronger on it uh, than gold. Um, gold seeming like it maybe wants to do uh, snail, but once again, that snail going back and forth and back and forth. So far, no queen does, so pretty good. Oh, there we go. Blue queen takes out the gold queen. Um, we have a speed gold soldier out and a regular gold soldier, so we'll see what they can do with that gold soldier. Um, gold soldiers can be quite deadly. Uh, in some situations, even deadlier than the queen. And uh, much better for shutting down workers. Ooh, gold soldier there. Chases down the blue queen, and now they're all tied up in uh, queen deaths. <laughs> Uh, pardon me. Uh, no, Gold Queen gets taken out. Um, that means she's on her last life. So will Blue just switch into a heavy military push and try to figure out? Oh no, there we go. Gold Speed Soldier taking out the Blue Queen. This is really just a, 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 a wall. Um, we both teams are pushing Econ, but their presence is felt much, much more in uh, in these military pushes that they're making. Um, we have uh, edge guarders in both hives right now, trying to harass. Uh, Blue Queen coming up maybe to, to clear that out, uh, but the Gold Queen swoops in and takes out the workers that were gonna benefit from that hive clear. Um, the snail, uh, unlike last game, has been mostly ignored in this game. Um, Blue is now having a slight edge on Econ. They have a, they have a clear hive, although uh, Gold Soldier coming up, uh, maybe to do something about that, but gets taken out by the Blue Soldier. Gold trying to clear their hive out, and they do with a little pincer attack between the Queen and uh, Soldier. Uh, Snail is moving there for Gold again, but uh, long dive from the Queen shut that down. Queen now hunting maybe for a little too heavily for the, uh, the Gold Queen. Uh, remember, both these Queens very vulnerable. Oh, and there we go. Gold Queen gets taken out uh, by a blue soldier, meaning that we are going to the final round, which means we'll be playing this uh, on the night map. Uh, first night map of the evening. Um, and this is, we'll be going, uh, this will be for the whole match. 
Um, pretty exciting. Pretty exciting. <clears throat> Checkers. Oh, I, yeah, that refers to the checkered. Uh, we call him Waffles here in New York. Uh, the, uh, the worker with the uh, checked pattern. Uh, we prefer the name Waffles. Uh, I think uh, it's funnier. Checkers is also pretty funny. Uh, so, you know. All right, both, uh, both teams, especially Blue, really uh, talking about strategy, trying to figure out a uh, night map. You know, uh, you play it less. Uh, it's, it's, you know, it's much more vertical uh, than, the, uh, than the day map. And so, uh, really, this can throw teams off. It's, uh, it's a real curveball, uh, especially for teams that have gotten very, very used to the day map. Uh, okay, so here we're going to jump in. This is uh, the final match. We have BYOB on gold and uh, hard workers on blue. Blue immediately starting to move the snail. Uh, I think expecting that, uh, you know, because this is a, a smaller snail distance, that, that that's the that's the uh, better play. Um, our gold coming in and shutting that down uh, fairly quickly. Uh, it looks like uh, gold is pushing econ. Um, <coughs> Uh, and, and doing so fairly undefended. Uh, so far, no one has tried to harass them out of it. And Blue is really, really concentrating on this snail. Uh, betting that this snail is because it's even shorter. Ooh, nice moves there by the Gold Queen, taking out two workers and a soldier and shutting that snail movement down. Um, really, really impressive. Uh, meanwhile, while Gold's econ uh, keeps going, uh, and they're only four berries away, the Queen coming down now. Oh, there we go, missing uh, the chance to push that berry out. Now the Gold is only three berries away from the Econ win, and they're moving the snail back. This is looking pretty good for them. Gold, uh, Blue Queen not doing a good job of shutting down this incoming Econ. Oh, and a Blue Soldier kicks a berry in, and there goes the last berry. Oh, Gold Queen kicks it in, and a Gold Worker picks it up for a nice finesse win there, uh, giving BYOB the win. 3-2. Uh, to two.